Hello guys, another video here. Today I'm gonna show you how to generate the um, X Horse Y remote. So I have two Philips remote right here and one of the normal ones. Basically, the X Horse remote um, it's to replace if you don't have an original one. Let's say like this one. Um, if, if you don't have the Honda ones, you can use this one right here, which has all the buttons that you need. And then let's say like let's say like this one you just have three button you can use this one right here which if you don't have it in the stock it's very handy to have the universal ones and then you can, you can use the same if you have the remote and the key separate and you want them together so you, you can use this one so the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna connect the, the wire to the board right here it just goes one side it doesn't doesn't go this this way just just one way and make sure the battery is out if the battery is in it won't work we go to Baco remote we select a Baco let's say let's say that we're working on a Honda and all remote let's close that one let's say we open a crb and we pick the vehicle right here it says crb and um always make sure the remote that you're gonna generate um the fcc id matches to the original one if the fcc id is not available make sure the year matches to the to the vehicle that you're working on and so just generate okay and this one is already and ready to program to the vehicle and the cool thing with um, the x horse remote even if you already have a vehicle program to the board um you still can use it reuse it using a different vehicle let's say let's say they're working on a ford close all remotes exploder and then let's say that we're gonna select this one like i said make sure the fcc id and the year matches to the remote that you want to generate if not it won't work at all and let's say we want to generate this one we generate it complete and then if you see right here this remote it just has four button on it and then the one that we just generated it has five the remote start it won't be available on this one and then on the Y remote from X Horus you can't change the settings um, a proximity key yes you can you can change the settings on those ones but on the wire ones you can't do that so in this case the customer it'll have just lock lock unlocked and panic and trunk so yeah the same thing it's this this one is the same thing we just select the vehicle that you're working on let's say let's uh, select another vehicle same thing ford i want to show you something really quick explode it again like this one right here let's say that we're working on an exploder if you see right here this is the fcc id and it tells you the year as well 98 through 2014 and then we generate takes a couple seconds complete so and then if you see right here this one it just has three buttons on it so if you use one of these so that means you won't have the trunk the lock unlock and the panic it'll work but not the trunk one so if you have one of this one this is perfect for that you have just the lock lock unlock and the panic there's no trunk so so yeah i hope this video gave you some information like and subscribe for more videos like this 
Thank you for watching. Take care.